it is, and certainly there's a very thorough discussion of uh, you know potential risks and any potential benefits when when we're consenting a patient to a clinical trial for gene therapy. There's uh, actually a good acceptance by the patient population, lots of interest. And I think this is really based upon what they've learned about our research as well as you know how the gene therapy could potentially address the limitations of the available enzyme replacement therapy. So you know some features of the enzyme replacement therapy that are you know potentially limitations include uh, the patients don't completely respond. Uh, they get a, uh, an initial benefit, but later many of them actually have some more progression of their weakness and they, they gradually might decline despite getting treatment with enzyme replacement. Um, another major, I think, advantage for gene therapy would be this feature to give it once and have a long-term effect. So enzyme replacement therapy, as, you're, as you know, involves repeated infusions for Pompe disease. This is now every one to two weeks. Uh, the patient is in the infusion center for hours at a time uh, for every treatment, uh, and that's, that's lifelong. Um, so when we see that, you know, the research suggests that gene therapy may be more beneficial and there could be an improved quality of life, I think those are maybe um, important to patients who are considering uh, enrolling in our clinical trial.